Hey guys, what's going on? It's Low for Low Notes here to help teach and inspire you through audio, video, and tech. And in this tutorial, we are learning how to do audio envelopes within Vegas Pro 15. Now, what is an audio envelope? Well, it is more of like a fancy designer volume fader for your audio tracks. Okay, all right. What does that look like? Well, if you can imagine, imagine the the volume of whatever your music or maybe your dialogue, and it's kind of going right here. Now, normally within Vegas Pro or whatever uh, uh, whatever software you like using, if you want to adjust the volume, it's either right here or you just bring down the slider, the fader, and it's boom, it's right here or it's right here, it's right here. There's no gradual decline or gradual going up. That's where the envelope comes in. So imagine we have our music right now, and then we just kind of want to slope it down to a level where you feel comfortable, and then maybe slope it back up and not have it go like this, then like this, shelf down, and then shelf back up and come like that. The envelope will give us a nice kind of smoothing down and a smoothing up. I can explain to you all day. Let me just show you what it looks like. So here's an example right here um, in the video, this video that I'm using, this project that I'm using in a series of tutorial videos for Vegas Pro 15. And you can see right here, I've got several peaks and valleys and they all kind of like slope and fade in and fade out. And what a probably real simple way is here's my outro and you can see how I have my music right here and then it just kind of slopes down to a comfortable level where the change in volume is not so jarring. It's kind of smooth. So let's take a listen. All right, squiggly, that is it. All right, so you can easily hear how it was high in energy and it just kind of slowly came down and kind of settled down for our voice to actually come in and pick in. Now, if you can see right here, I said voice, and I normally have these audio envelopes coming in whenever I am speaking. So it's not in competition with the music as much. So if we look right here, let me slide over here. You can see right here, like this is dialogue right here. It's flying, Mr. Wood's flying. There's dialogue here. All right, you guys ready for takeoff? I have dialogue here. All right, Squiggly, you ready? Yeah. All right. I want you to follow it. And then it goes back up. All right, so how do we do this? All right, well, let's reset all of these points. Reset all. Boom, it's all gone. All of my hard work is gone. <laughs> oh, my God. What have I done? All right, so this is the volume we're going to set our music at by default. Like, woo! Okay, we don't want to go anywhere. But just all right, now let's create our points for our envelope. And usually whenever you're doing a point, a an envelope point system like this, where you want to drop your dialogue, uh, no, where you want to drop the music where your dialogue is happening, you're, you're going to need four points. So you can add your points two different ways. You can either right click and add a point, or you can double click at a point and add a point. Now, from here, this is why we're going to need four. You see if I do this, it brings out the entire thing. We don't want that to happen. We need to add a set of two more points right here and right here. Then we can actually bring down this part where we get a nice, a nice fade. I can even adjust this back here to make the fade even longer, or I can bring it back here to make the fade even shorter. Let's bring it right here and let's take a listen. It's flying, Mr. Wood's flying. Sounds super smooth. So let's do the same thing over here. And we'll, we'll drag it down. Okay, we'll, we'll adjust it so it looks a little more smoother. All right, you guys ready for takeoff? Yeah. Ready to go. And we'll do it one more time. We'll go over here, add more points, points here, points here. And remember, at any time, you can drag the, the, the points anywhere you want. To give you more control of it, let's bring it down here. <laughs> All right, Squiggly, you ready? Yeah. All right. I want you to follow it. That, that's it, really simple. Let's try the same thing at the end. I will reset the points at the end. All right, this is where my dialogue is. I will zoom in. I will bring my points right here. And I guess this time around, I can actually just, nope, I don't want that. I still need my, I still need my second point. And I will bring it down. Oh, no. Yes, right there. Okay, and I can go over here. Now you can see how it's kind of like a, a, a little weird motion over here. I can add another point here so I can actually... Nope. I'll add another point here. So I can bring that up. 
Come on, man, work with me. Let's, let's do it at the same time. Just that one. There we go. All right, so we'll do it again. All right, squiggly. That is it. Uh and just like that, if you right click on the line, like you can see before, you have different uh, fades that you can adjust to it a linear, fast fade, a slow fade. You can go ahead and just mess with those. You're going to go in between the two fade markers and you can just hold one. I'm not hold one, but do one. Look at it. You got a different kind of fade right there. All right. Scoop down. So you can go ahead and play with the different fades. You can reset, flip all the points, then all the points, you know, and you just got plenty of options. And that's it, guys. Take advantage of the audio envelope within Vegas Pro 15 to make your audio sound a little more smoother when doing transitions of your audio. It's as simple as that. Make sure to come back to the channel. Look out for more Vegas Pro 15 tutorial, guys, featuring this project. Okay, guys, if you liked the video, go ahead, leave a like. If you loved it, feel free to subscribe. Leave a comment down below if you have any questions about using audio envelopes within Vegas Pro 15. Until next time, guys, I will see you in the next video. Take care. Bye.